guys welcome back to another video and today i'm going to be showing you how to clean up your alpha bracelets so they look nice neat and professional so what you need for this video is you or sorry tutorial i should say you are going to need a brace alpha bracelet with all of the strings that you need like that you that we're going to fix up sticking out you need scissors and optional glue stick or some glue because if you don't if you're worried about your string fraying you can just glue the ends a bit like I like to rub some on there so they don't fray so to start out with I'm just gonna straighten out some of these all right so basically for cleaning up your bracelets you need to um Sorry, I'm just a little. You need to make sure that if you have any that are sticking out of the side, like this, Spar finished off her bubble gum that she's blowing. You can see it just sticks out the side, or for this yellow background there that's just sticking out the side. We need to do something about that because if I just trim it, it's going to be sticking out of my bracelet or bookmark. So I, you have to find a little loop somewhere this is what this is what i like to do so find a little loop and then tuck the thread under the loop so my brown one got caught under there when i was nodding but anyways um so kind of push all the others out of the way and then i like to find just a little loop so this white one looks like it'll fit and then i like to carefully just pull it up a little bit here, my string is fraying while I do this, so I'm going to have to be extra careful. But I can just tuck it right under my little loop there on the bracelet. So it does take a bit of time because you're trying to tuck it under. So look, now you can see that it's stuck under there. So now I can pull it a bit and then flip it over. And now you cannot see it. Like, you can't really tell. So I'm going to do that with my yellow thread, my pink thread, and then I will come back to you guys. Now tucked both of them under that little white loop. So now what I'd like to do, sorry if it's kind of difficult for you guys to see it, because I know there's a lot of thread and stuff, so it's kind of distracting. But I like to do a little knot and knot them in place. So now you can see that there. And then I'll just carefully trim that off. And so now I have all this excess thread, which I can put in my scrap pile to use for future projects. So now that you have those two long ones gone, um, I'm going to find all the other ones. And these ones, they stopped in the middle of the pattern, stopped using the gray, and the gold yeah. right there and it's not on the edge like the other two so for this these ones I can just carefully trim them and they are tucked under some other thread so I will just trim those off okay now this knot it's kind of poking out the side now which is just fine because I can take a little bit of my glue stick and I can just put a little bit on there and then I have it stick down onto my bracelet and I don't usually do this if I'm wearing the bracelet but I like to do it for bookmarks and stuff because it doesn't really matter so I can kind of stick it down and it helps it from fraying and it sticks there Okay, so now I need to... Sorry about that, my camera... Um, my phone died, so... I'm very sorry about that. But anyway, like I was saying before my phone died, um, we can just trim off all of these little small bits of thread. So like all the small ones that are sticking out and not long pieces of thread. So you kind of just want to, here I'll hold it up more so you can see, kind of just want to carefully trim them, not too close to the bracelet, 
but enough so they're not sticking out of the sides. And then I'll do these last ones here. Just being very careful not to actually um, cut any of the knots that are on your bracelet because that would not be very good. All right, so I have those ones done. Just clear up my workspace. All right, so now I have these final ones on the bottom here. And for these ones, I'm going to glue them down because the pattern ended right there. And then I have my skin tone colors and my black. So I'm going to trim them close. And then I'm going to get a little bit of my glue. And I'm going to carefully just rub like a little teensy bit on there. Um, you can also do this with, um, with like a glue bottle, like liquidy glue. But I like to use this stuff because then it, I prefer to use this because it kind of, it dries faster. And it dries clear and stuff. Alright, I got glue on my hands. Okay, so now because I did this hole in the top for a bookmark, I have these two strings hanging out the sides. So what I need to do is I'm just going to trim these a bit shorter too. And I will now get some glue so that I can glue them down and have my nice neat bracelet. Also, if you want the tutorial for the hole in the bookmark, there's a tutorial by a YouTube channel called Handmade Linen, and it is in another language, but she has subtitles, and it's pretty clear to follow just by looking at it too. Like, you don't really need the, um, the words and the commentary over it. All right, so, now I'm just gonna go back in. Oops, sorry, you couldn't see it. I'm so sorry. Um, but I'm just gonna kind of go back in and trim it up, fix it up. Also, if you're wondering about this pattern, I will link it in the description. Um, it's from the Princess Diaries because I requested a Princess Diaries pattern because I like the books in the movie. But this pattern is like, um, oh no, sorry, it's a. In the movie, the role is played by, of the main character is played by Anne Hathaway. And this is the picture, like, this is the, oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, I can't think of the right word to say. But anyway, this is just her from the movie. And it says princess in the background, but she's kind of covering it up. And I have this really cute little tassel and a twisted tie. And then I have these little triangle ends. So thank you guys so much for watching my video. I know it was kind of short, but I hope it did help out some of you guys for learning how to clean up your alpha bracelets nice and neat. So they can look really pretty and they don't have threads sticking out the edges. Um, please like this video and subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet comment for more ideas and if you like this bracelet or if this tutorial helped you um happy thanksgiving because i'm filming on the day of thanksgiving yay but um have a happy thanksgiving stay safe and make sure to yeah just stay safe like i said before and yeah i'll see you guys later bye